today I have come to uh, Fakir Chand book stall. It's a very popular book store in uh, Delhi. And actually, my friends know I'm not a very book person. But uh, Deep Lakshmi, my friend, she dragged me here, saying it's a very good place and she wants to come here. Hi. How are you? I'm good, thank you. How are you? I'm good. And how is it? Did you buy any book? Yeah, I'm thinking of getting this, uh, Notes on Grief. Okay. I hadn't actually heard about it, but I read the abstract at the back. I think I'm going to like it. It's a hardback copy of Adichie. Great. So you have been coming here since long? I have been in Delhi since 2014. Yeah, it's not a good copy of but uh, I think, I don't remember the first time I came here, but the last time I came here was uh, a few months back. And yeah, it's one of my favorite bookstores in Delhi. What do you like the best about the place? may not be something many people like about bookstores because I like how unorganized this place is. It reminds me of uh, one of my favorite bookstores in Bangalore, uh, where I did my bachelor's. It was Blossom's Bookstore, and uh, there too the books were organized in a very unorganized way. <laughs> so That's the beauty of it, na? Yeah. yeah. And I feel like it's a... I, I mean, if you're a lover of books, it feels like almost a labyrinth. I mean feels like an adventure so you get to spend a lot of time just browsing through books and sometimes you just chance upon something that you really like and I think most of the times uh, the booksellers themselves also are very familiar with their collection so if you're looking for uh, some specific book if you ask them they're usually able to help you so even if they don't have a catalog they are uh, well acquainted with their collection and they are able to help you out. It's a very cramped space with lots of books and sometimes I wonder what's behind this pile that you don't even know. So there are piles and piles of books behind this uh, pile that you can see. Mm. So it's like kind of an adventure like I already said. Oh, my favorite section is this one. And it's full of modern classics and I really like uh, how the covers of these books are so homogeneous, like we have blue covers and red covers because mm. I'm not really fond of book covers distracting readers from the content of their books, although I do get how covers are important. But then this is, yes, this is my favorite section. Usually whenever I come here, I spend a lot of time here. And my purchases are also usually from this section. And today too, I think I'm going to get something from this section itself. Uh, maybe something of, uh, by Sylvia Plath uh, for one of my friends. I'm not familiar with her works, but then my friend is a great fan of Sylvia Plath. Hi, do you regularly come here? No, do you regularly come here? we are shifted to Delhi. Recently? Yeah. Okay. So how do you like the place? The place is in uh, the store, I'm The store, the store, yeah, it's, it's really warm. <laughs> the outdoor, like very... Cold. Like it's, it's really warm, it feels like you are into some award mm. for books. <laughs> Like we can spend a lot of time here. What did you buy? I'm or buy planning to buy? I'm planning to buy this for a friend. Because okay. she's interested in politics, history and fiction. So, mm-hmm. so you're students? Yes. Yeah, we are students. DU? Yeah. Okay, I also passed out from DU. Long back. Oh, really? 2008. <laughs> huh? You're in class 6? Oh, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> no, I don't. It's my first time. And I have been to this market earlier, but to this shop, this is my first time. My friend brought me here. Uh, this is the original one. 
and this one is the original in hindi by gitanjali shri and this is the translated one by daisy rockwell so uh, this won the international booker prize in this year but you see the difference in size in the thickness <laughs> and as mentioned by jyoti <laughs> like we usually hear the phrase lost in translation but here we find something that's gained in translation <laughs> maybe <laughs> or maybe we just need more words in hindi to express what is already been written in hindi but then we do find uh, a lot of copies of uh, red samadhi as well as tomb of sand so we find that uh, these bookstores they do keep up with the times hmm. And, and these books are placed right at the entrance and the exit. Yeah. Huh. yeah because they right. are the current favorites now. Yeah. Huh. And I have also heard of people coming in and asking specifically for Red Samadhi. I did that. Oh, okay. <laughs> nah, just to see uh, yeah. if they if they keep it. Hmm. So they know what's going to work. Hmm. It's marketing strategy. Yeah. Because you do need to survive. You can't survive for around the century because i think fakir chand was established in 1931 first in pakistan yeah and then in 1951 in khan market mm-hmm. delhi i think yeah. so we get without marketing strategies no you won't survive and thanks for uh, following this marketing strategies it's good for us book lovers they also have a kids section there comics also as well as uh, story books for children illustrated novels also for children i also noticed uh, a little girl reading a book and i mm. really love it when i and it plays played some sound also that book oh it did. yeah i thought i'll get it for my nephew oh okay the hindi section here is also quite famous oh because they keep books of manko All these people, Sahir Rutyanvi, he used to write in Urdu. So I think it's a Urdu to English translation. Ma'am, आप लोग का तो shop काफी पुराना है. And before there, it was in Pakistan. Which place in Pakistan? Peshawar. Peshawar. Hi, I came with you. So there is some kind of classification. Ah, uh-huh. right. The classics will be the last right corner. But the study wants anything on Delhi, then this is here. Oh, Kashmir yeah. is on top. Pakistan. So, right. And can you please tell me what do you do with the old books or uh, the ones which you think are not selling? So we stock them on top, and later sooner they sell. So 
you know, not a course book that uh, the course will change. Usually most of the books which are old, they go out of print mm. and they are more valuable for the customer. Mm. And he says, I, I was searching for this book and now I found it here. So, so you don't have to go down? We don't, we don't need to. No, no, no. We don't so, need to. Then you outline the outfit. And also don't dispose of any books. You don't, whether there's no need? Mm. No, everything gets sold. Ha ha ha. We have a good clientele. Mm. And even the old, uh, the books which are old and soiled also. The customer doesn't mind uh, buying that because he says it's not available. Mm. And even when he checks on Amazon, it's not available. When your father migrated here, did he bring his collection of books also or did he start from scratch? He just brought one small bag full of clothing. Yeah. And nothing else had to leave everything behind. And he was happy that he and his family reached alive when yeah. people were being massacred on the way. Yeah. And the trains were being butchered, total trains were coming all butchered from here. Vice versa from Amisa to Lahore and Lahore to here. So, they, they were alive there, I think, and, and uh, all their uh, hand and legs were intact, they were happy with that. Mm. So, he started from scratch here? Yeah. Right, and there used to be a rehabilitation camp here, old for, you know, Purana Kila. The rehabilitation camp, tents were not there. People didn't have food or anything. So, when they were there, people were given food and shelter for the tent. Okay. So that in the meanwhile then the government and all, there was a rehabilitation ministry mm. who helped them out and gave them some money, you find some jobs here. Yeah. So that is the scene. So you must have seen this place change a lot over the past. Huh? <laughs> so it is as old as me, 1951 born. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> I am too, too much younger to the shop. <laughs> <laughs> this artwork is really famous. Aditya Raji has done this watercolor, oh. and so you can keep on it. Okay, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. He's a professional painter. He's yeah. good at it. Maya, the Austin Sufi also is coming. He's twice a week. Yeah. He's in the Lodi Garden, the Khan Market, yeah. and then the Dargah. It's stamped also. See? Right. Hmm? Get your book stamped. Oh. <laughs> we have the stamp now. Okay. Yes. Your Korean, we say ah. please stamp on the first day. Yes. Oh, job. Give me a perspective. Yeah. Ah. You know, maintaining the charm of hmm. hundreds of books.